Let's take a look at fractions on a T89 calculator. Our first problem, we want to simplify this fraction. Okay, so let me put it in there. And then we're going to talk about the different displays we see. 40 divided by 72, enter, and C reduces it to 5 ninths. Maybe. Depends upon your mode. If I press my mode button, here's the mode button, and I go down to the second page. You can down arrow to it and go to it, or you can push the F2 to go to it. On the second page, what you're going to find is an exact approximate, and uh, mine says auto. If you right arrow over to it, if you have approximate set, and I push enter, and then enter to save. And now if you put in your 40 divided by 72 and do enter, you get a decimal. So you may not get that fraction if you have that option set. So in order to get it to reduce your fraction, you have to go into your mode. I'm going to push F2 to go to page 2. And then I come down to exact, proximate, right arrow, and then up arrow, and I want to choose exact. So I did an enter on it. Now do enter to save. And now, when you do your 40 divided by 72, and push enter, you'll see it reduces to 5 ninths. Okay, let's take a look at our second uh, second item here, addition. Okay, so I'm going to do 1 divided by 36 plus 2 divided by 27, enter, and you see we got 11 over 108. Now subtraction. I'm going to do 2 divided by 5 minus 1 divided by 3, and push enter, and we get uh, 115. Um, multiplication. So I'm going to do 14 divided by 21 times 9 divided by 7, and push enter, and we get 6 sevenths. Now notice it gives you a weird display over here. If that bothers you, it's still correct um, uh, order of operations wise. But if that bothers you, what you can do is you can put parentheses around each fraction. So I do a beginning parentheses, 14 divided by 21. Ah, let me try it again. Okay, so beginning parentheses, 14 divided by 21. Closing parentheses times. Beginning parentheses, 9 divided by 7. Closing parentheses. Now if I do enter, it'll still give me the same result, but over here you won't see that bizarre um, calculation form. Now for division. For division, it's always a good idea when you're dividing fractions on any calculator to put parentheses around each fraction. So here you'll find in many calculators that's necessary. So if I do a beginning parentheses, 20 divided by 27, closing parentheses, divided by, beginning parentheses, 10 divided by 18, closing parentheses, and then push enter, that gives us our 4 thirds. And one last one. This is a complex fraction, a fraction inside of a fraction. And the trick to that is to put parentheses around top, parentheses around the bottom. So I'll do a beginning parentheses, 1 divided by 3, plus 1 divided by 5, closing parentheses, divided by, beginning parentheses, 1 divided by 7, minus 2, and then closing parentheses. And then I'll push enter. And that gives us negative uh, 56 over 195. And that's how you do fractions on a T89 uh, calculator.